Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here. What's the name of this game? Going Medieval. I almost forgot for a second there. I've been playing too much room room. Okay, I've got a few changes I'm going to make um, based on another playthrough that I've been doing. I'm not recording it, but I'm just playing the game in a different save file. It's way ahead of this one. Um, and I'm, I've learned a few things along the way. So I'm going to change the just the layout a little bit and the plan a little bit. The, the AI mechanics are actually very kind of rudimentary. Um, when you get attacked, they just go for your your guys and gals, your colonists. So it's not very smart like RimWorld. It won't go for strategic things. And later on, they get battering rams and bust through doors. And even after that, they get catapults and stuff, trebuchets. And then they can start destroying your buildings. But early on, they just try to go for the front door. So I'm actually going to remove this door here. We're going to put walls everywhere except for the front here. And then we're going to build a way up, up top. And I think what I'm going to do is make like a place in between here. We'll go maybe, we'll just have one door, but we'll have like maybe space of four on the other side. Or Yeah, four should be good. Yeah, <coughs> sorry, the idea here is we'll make one main entrance. Everything will try to attack here. Well, let's go on the other side here as well. So, one, two, three, four. Fifth one. I think I've done that right. This is a little bit wider than I have in my other base, but um, I think it'll work. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it's symmetrical, kind of. Doesn't quite line up with the front door, but. Should be good. And then we'll put a door here. And then we gotta like build the wall around the whole base still, but let's replace this one. So they'll have to go out the front door, which is fine. It'll be less efficient than having the four, the four exits. The other thing I'm gonna do is remove this butcher table and put everything indoors. And I'm gonna join these two buildings together, I think, instead of having them separate. And I think I'll probably stop putting roofs on buildings. And the reason is that I think I'll just put a floor instead to serve as a roof. So if we wanted to keep going building up, we can. And I want to go pretty big with this base eventually, so. And I'm gonna so I'm gonna join these together. And this one is 16 wide, so I might do the same thing just for consistency. One, two, three, four. Oop. Four, that's the wrong place. There's a slight delay when you cancel a building. It's kind of interesting. Some kind of lag. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Where did I have on the side? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, that's good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then this will be the door. Door is. These doors, as you guys uh, mentioned, they're kind of weird. They're not facing the right way. They're just kind of two single doors, but I guess it's fine. We kind of don't need a front door here. We could have them go through the side here and not even have to go outside, but I think we'll leave it for now. Let me a door here, copy that. I guess we should be s symmetrical. Have a double door. We, can we make this look correct? Can't really tell which which side the doorknob's on. And oh, they're in the center now. Okay, I can probably fix this one. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I just have to go one over, so we're gonna have to remove this wall. And I gotta be careful I don't run out of food before. What are we in? We're in spring day 11, so summer's coming soon. It'll get hot. The other thing we need is to start digging a tunnel down to build a basement for our food. Because it's colder the deeper you go. This was going to be a great hall. But a great hall has to be, let's see here, I think it has to be 50. Great hall. Um, let's pause here. Minimum grid space area, 50. 
16 by how wide is this let's let's rotate one two three four five six seven eight nine oh i really should have done it 10 but hmm hmm well they're sleeping at the moment they do all have bedrooms in here. Let's remove the roof here so we can see inside. Turn the room overlay off again. They're all floating in in the air here. Maybe this will become like a massive bunkhouse. Right now it's kind of a storage room. The other thing I want to get going is to make sure our smith. We do have a smith that has decent, decent score here, 14. And I'm pretty far into the tech tree on my other save, so I realized you need to level up smithing. And you kind of have to make some a bunch of short swords or whatever to get this up. And it's pretty slow going. It actually takes quite a while to make a short sword. You get about a level out of it, so it's okay that way, but... Okay, so let's finish this room off here. Let's put this... We could change out the back. Actually, we're not, we'll just leave it nine nine wide it'll be fine right there this actually makes my computer run pretty hot as you can probably hear maybe you can't one two three four five six seven destroying some natural berry bushes okay looks good copy that Yeah, so we could put a door in right over here, beside, underneath the stairs, kind of. Whoa, whoa, let's go down here. We could put a door right in here. I think safely. Um, so let's actually do that. Let's deconstruct that. Hopefully nothing falls down. This way they don't technica technically need to go outside. When the winter comes, if it's cold out, they won't have to go outside. Let's stick a door right here. I think that's right. Oh my gosh, there we go. And we need more floor. So we'll copy this wicker floor. We got lots of sticks, right? 766 sticks. Okay, that's going well. I guess we could have put a door on the second level as well. Like out here, under the second floor. Uh, it's almost night time, I think. What time of the day is it? Yeah, it's almost night time. Our food's coming along, that's good. And our flax is coming along, so we're getting some cloth. Got some herbs and spices. What else have we grown here? Red currant. This is for wine and food. Okay, here we go. We're getting linen cloth. Uh, we're going to need more storage because look at this mess. We also don't want our books to rot anywhere or we'll be in trouble. We kind of need some storage rooms as well. I think for now we'll put some storage in here. Or should we just continue on in here? We could do that. And we're going to go down through the earth here. Let's change up our schedule a bit. I'm going to give them an extra sleeping block. It's probably unnecessary, but we'll do it. And then we'll give them two blocks of leisure, and the rest is open. And the jobs, we want to specialize here. So we've got some, well, Look at this, Christian. Look at these passions. Passionate, passionate, double passion. Crazy. What do we want them doing the most? Carpentry. Wow. Well, I guess we'll... Oh, summer is here. Okay. I guess we'll get them to do harvesting the most and plant cutting. This one, Ramsey's good at mining, so we'll get him in mining and constructing. Just specializing here as best we can. There's no one, uh, there's no one who loves cooking. Carpentry. 
We'll, we'll be getting more people, so it won't be that bad. And no one is mining. Let's make sure someone's someone's on mining here. Uh, mining, we'll make that a one for now, just to get that dug out. Assuming they can do it. What are they doing over here? All the harvesting and stuff. Okay. So they have a way up here, and if we put all the guys up here, they should try to attack them. They, they can come up the stairwell, which is not great. So let's at least extend this a little bit more. And I gotta pick where that the border is gonna be. I wanna leave lots of room to expand. I missed a bit of floor in here, so we'll fix that up. I don't want to overbuild and have a bunch of rooms that we're not using just yet, but uh, let's extend our storage inside here. We have a mismatched floor, but that's okay. Let's extend this storage zone, just cover everything basically. They can walk over, they, they walk over a little bit slower, but it's okay. Okay, no one really wants to mine here. Let's shrink this path here. So yeah, we want that cellar before... Actually, we need the cellar in summer, otherwise food will rot. Don't really need it in the winter. The other thing I should be doing is kind of setting all their gear here. So manage headgear. Good armor. Oh, interesting. I think I made this good armor in a diff in my other save file. I did. I don't remember doing it here. We'll do it. Hmm. I think I just changed. We'll just allow everything. It needs some hit points though. So we'll save that. All apparel. All headgear. Guess that's fine. We want another archer. So who? What are our skills like here? Marksman five. Melee two. So once we get another bow, we'll get Christian to be a an archer. Same thing with Nicholas. It's just we. I don't think we have the extra bows just yet. Why is no one mining? Construct mine number one. Maybe there's something wrong here. Maybe they can't reach it or something. Maybe the floor is in the way. Let's deconstruct the wicker floor. I don't think that's the problem, but we'll deconstruct it anyway. Yeah, we got food rotting already because it's so hot. Everything's decomposing. So this should actually be the priority. Get the food in the basement. Let them have their entertainment. Get a little praying in. As they do. Okay. There, Ramsey's hopefully going to start digging now. Yeah, there they go. I think they needed to break the floor to get through there. Let's make... Let's try that. We'll put the stairway just under here. Okay, boys, we're going down. Going down into the depths. Stick that right here in the pit. Right. Oh, come on. Is that, let me put it, let me put it exactly where I want it, game. Right there, there we go. So we got a little bit of a landing. We go down a level, and then we can start digging even deeper. How exactly want to, do I want to do this? Um, can't. It's saying I can't build here. Oh, not enough resources. Okay. Oh, we got another person who wants to join. We are going to let them join, of course. Of course we are. And let's go cut some more trees, because we're out of wood. Cut the ones... We want some a good clear 
clear line of sight in the front here so that we can see the enemies coming. I can hear the wood chopping horses. This sometimes happens, they get exhausted even though they've slept the whole night. Uh, we could be doing some more research, but I'll hold off for now. Cooking would be good. We already have basic cooking though. Do, we, do I have any meals being cooked? Yeah, we set that up last time. Influence is rising. This is sure to attract more settlers, that's good. Let's check the region map. Here's a little influence thing here, okay. I might have gone a little bit overkill with the food. It might rot away in here. Decomposes in five days. We'll have to get the cellar done in five days here. Okay, I could turn the corner here, but what we're going to do is we're going to go even deeper. How am I going to do this? Oh, we need this post here. Let's go down there. I think I have to dig this out. What's that going to do? That's going to cause this post to break, potentially. We can't really turn the corner or th this will be uh, empty under here. We could put a beam here instead, but I think I'm just going to dig. Oh, it's hard to, hard to see here. Uh, we'll go deeper here. It's still hard to see. <laughs> it's a little bit kind of tricky to get the, um, the three-dimensional digging here perfectly. Uh, I want to dig this one here in front of me, but it's kind of hard. There we go. If that post breaks, we can put a beam underneath, I think. Barley field. You know what, I'm gonna kill the barley field. Because we got a red current field, that should be enough. Okay, here we go, we're digging. These guys can get stuck as well, so you gotta be careful. So we're going to dig straight ahead, another one, and then down. They may get stuck here. It's entirely possible that they get stuck in a hole. Sometimes they fall into the hole. It's wise to build the stairs. Yeah, I think he's stuck now and it's going to complain about being idle. So, um, we can dig the pile underneath them. We're going to go and do that first. Oh, we got out. <laughs> okay. That's good. Um, I do want to put another stairwell in here. I didn't really plan this through very well, as you can probably tell. Uh, can we put a stairwell underneath here? kind of want it to be at the bottom of these stairs. But I think we need to dig that out first. And then when we're down two levels, we can turn the corner and basically build a basement. Culinary's up to level 24. Build up your defenses. Yeah, no kidding. If they become idle, we'll continue to build this... Um, this wall out here because we do want to seal in the base. Is that reachable? I don't think that's reachable now. I think I've kind of screwed myself here to be honest. We might have to um hmm we might have to <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do here. Uh what's the proper way to build these things? I should have built the landing and we could have turned the corner. Maybe we still can do that. 
Okay, let's do that. Let's dig this out. This will make sense, I promise. Maybe. I think I'll put a landing. We'll, we'll fill that back in underneath here. So we get a little landing down there and then we'll turn the corner and go down from there. But I just need to kind of dig out some area here so I can see what I'm doing. All our stuff is kind of floating in the air now and we run out of storage. Okay, let's make a storage area. This will be temporary. But we don't want our stuff stuck outside. We'll let everything get piled up in there. And let's shrink this storage area. If I can select it. Um, hello. Maybe we have to go down one, up one. Did I clear the whole thing? Show. There it is. <laughs> I can't select it though. Jeez. There it is. Got to be on the right Z level. Okay, we're going to shrink this zone here. And it keeps deselecting. Ugh. Yeah, UI is a little bit clunky sometimes. Okay, we go down there. We turn the corner. We go down even deeper. It's kind of hard to see what you're building. And you can go down like this, but still, it's kind of it's kind of hard to see what you're doing. Gonna have to actually clear this, I think. Jeez. Where is this? Oh my gosh, I can't see what the heck I'm doing. Now I can't select it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, game. Let's just clear this whole section. But it won't let me. Shrink zone, please, let me do it. Game's not cooperating. Or I'm just an idiot. Uh, hello? Come on. Oh, jeez. There. Please let me shrink the damn zone. Okay. How about this tile, folks? What's uh, what's up with this tile? There we go. Shrink this. Okay, now we can see what we're doing. I'm gonna deconstruct. We'll have to be careful what we deconstruct here. The floor first. Oh boy. They should be able to build these columns down here as well. Got food rotting. Uh, meanwhile, they're moving everything over, which is fine. I guess this is going to be the storage room, folks, <laughs> for now. <laughs> That'll be the storage room. Um, this will be the basement entrance. Maybe we'll just rip up the whole floor so we can see what we're doing. of a waste of their timing but it'll be worth it it'll become clear okay orders deconstruct don't technically need to deconstruct all this but okay can they come build these columns please it should be possible settlers are idle these should be buildable But maybe they are not. For some reason. 
They should be. They should be able to walk down to the bottom of the stairs and build them. But it's not happening. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, right there. Should be able to build that. Prioritize, please. Cannot start construction. Need to clear area first. Oh crap! There's some debris that fell down there. So now we're screwed. Um. Hmm. 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 We might have to build another set of stairs. I don't really know what I'm going to do here. I've kind of screwed the pooch. My stairway down. It wasn't. It was much easier the first time I did this in another playthrough. Um. You know what? We'll just kind of brute force our way through here. Uh, I guess some of them could be cutting trees while we do this, or building the external. How much wood do we have? Five thirty. Let's at least getting them chopping wood. If they're idle, that's no good. Okay, we're going to try to mine this last column here. We're going to build another set of stairs so we can get the heck down there. Double stairway. Temporary, I hope. They're not going to be able to get that debris, so we're basically... Can't get down there now. And really, they should be mining first before anything else. Ramsey, why are you... What are you doing? Come and do your job. Instead of wasting our time. Okay, that's dug. Let's put some stairs in. Even though I already built my stairs, but I kind of screwed myself there. Okay, now we can start going to the right. Ah. I'm going to turn the corner. I'm going to have to move some of these things around. I think uh, we could dig this way now. Hmm. Who would have thought building would be so tough? Building down. Come on, stairs. Okay, we got our stairs. Now we can dig this way. It's just kind of crazy that I have to do this, but we could have built a storage thing down here instead. Let's copy this building, the basic research table. We'll stick that um, over here so we have some room. And deconstruct this one. Okay, research table listing, that's fine. I'm sure there's a better way to do this. I'm just uh, not very smart. Hailstorm. In the middle of summer. I guess that's okay. Okay, here we go. We're going deep. I think this is just a floating floor now. <laughs> okay, now we want to go... Now I want to go deeper. We got this little bit of a landing here. Um... Which way do I want to go? I want to go... Put a stairway down here, maybe. Or right here. So let's mine. A 
Okay, this column. This, this, this. That'll be our next level down. Temperature is 21, but it's hailing. Okay. Okay, hopefully this works. I kinda got stuck here. <laughs> Hopefully we can plop a stairway in here and go even deeper. There we go. Come on. There we go. And that way we can dig underneath without uh, disrupting the level above it. We didn't really need this huge landing here, but... Okay, now we can go deeper. Let's go deeper here. Let's go deeper. Okay, then get down here. Now we can just start digging like crazy. Okay, we'll... We'll turn the corner here, and we'll make a kind of a big cellar in here. We can always expand it later, but... Those are idle. Let's go get them chopping some more trees. Let's chop some trees over here. And you need a door to preserve the temperature. But it should be nice and cool down here. We can always go deeper if we need to, but. We'll stick a door right here at the bottom of the stairs. And this will be our cellar and we'll just keep expanding it as we need more food storage. Super useful, otherwise your food just, you grow it and it rots and it's no fun. So, how's this food doing? Rots in five days. We got lots of lumber now, so I can extend the wall as well. Let's copy this. We're gonna go. How far should we go? Let's take it over to. You know what? We're going. We're going big eventually. So let's go over to here, and then I should measure out another segment in here. We want to go three wide, uh, so we're overshooting a little bit. It's not really symmetrical either, but that's that's okay. I'm not going to count this off. I think it should be fine. We can always go deeper. Hmm. Do we want symmetry? I think we do. How many how many columns do we have here? One, two, three, f one, two, three, four, four. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna build a back wall here. Let's make sure it lines up. Okay, we'll, we'll build the front wall first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, I wanted seven. And a couple doors. We won't actually build this building yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a space for four. One, two, three, four, and then that'll be the wall. Okay, that's that'll be nice. Beautiful. Okay, hopefully I measure that all right. If not, it's too late. How's the digging operation going here, folks? Well, slowly, very slowly, but Ramsey's doing a good job. Let's get someone to prioritize this door, because I want to show you the temperature differential.
Okay, now we got a spare room. And let's pause and look at the oh, room overlay. Let's click here. Room temperature, room temperature minus 0 0.8. It's 24 degrees outside. Point, minus 0 0.8 down here. Perfect. Perfect. Things will never rot. This is absolutely fantastic. And I think we're gonna we're gonna make this even bigger. We'll go four wide and we'll go pretty deep here. And we'll put a storage zone for the food in here and then get all the food underground. Let's turn the room overlay off. So yeah, temperature control, super helpful. I'm gonna start the zone and we're gonna make it clear all except for food and actually medicine. Herbs can rot. I don't know if medicine can rot, but we'll put it in there as well. And then up top, if we can go up. This storage space will clear food and herbs and healing kits. There we go. Beautiful. Got another food crop coming in. Good. People are hungry, even though there's tons of food. How many meals do we have? I don't think we have a dedicated cook. Let's make sure we got someone on. Who likes cooking? Who's good at cooking? 24. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's make you cook first before anything. Because you're great at it. And let's make sure... We got enough meals prepped. We got 20. Oh, we got 20 meals. We want to group the resources. That's what I should have done before. So food. Yeah, we got 17 meals. Perfect. Let's go down deep here again. Oh, I like it. Let's extend that zone. Oh, we need a floor. We need a floor. Crap. Because things will rot without a floor. Wicker floor. Uh, decomposes in 16 days because of ground type. Once we fix the floor, if the temperature is still minus whatever in here. Oh, now it's 14. Hmm. Well, that's the bedroom. Sorry. I was clicked on the wrong. Uh, default stockpile. That's not what I want. Minus 1.2. Perfect. Okay. Things are coming together. This is like building the freezer in RimWorld. You want to do that pretty early. I've been spending a lot of time indoors um, due to COVID and stuff and occasionally I get out there for a walk or whatever, but it's been a while, it's been a couple days since I've been outdoors, but I took the garbage out tonight. And it's just kind of, you know, that twilight kind of time of day and I'm like, wow, the graphics out here are amazing. The real world has really high resolution. I just kind of stood outdoors for a couple minutes and soaked it up. I need to go outdoors more often. Okay, how's our food doing now? Let's turn the room overlay back off. Look at this, red corn pile. No more rotting. Perfect. Now this thing's gonna have to be pretty big eventually. I don't think we have to go any deeper. We might, during the heat wave, there's a heat wave at the end of each summer, I think. It might uh, get a little bit warm in here. We can always go deeper if we need to. I think we can probably safely mine this out as well. I don't think there's, I don't think it caves in actually. I think you could build this as big as you wanted and you'd be fine. I think. Don't quote me on that. I guess we could experiment and see if the roof caves in.
Okay, so that's underway. Oh, they're putting food down here without a floor. Make sure we got a wicker floor in there. Okay. I think that's all good. Oh, wait, I missed this little bit of floor here. We may want to put a little pathway for them at some point, but we're just going to load it to the gills right now. Okay, that project's underway. How's the storage looking? Not bad. Uh, this wasn't intended to be a storage room, but let's finish the perimeter first because it's going to make defending the base a lot easier. How deep do we want to go here? This will be a growing area. I might make these buildings a little bit deeper at some point, but let's leave room for expansion. I know this is this is huge. This is overkill, but it's not a big huge investment. Let's chop this down. Oops. Chop this down. Clear the wall area and then get this wall over there as well. You could build a like a moat. You could dig a moat, but it's much faster to build a wall than to dig a trench. I might still dig a trench around the outside, but I think it's redundant. The idea with these little walls here is that the archers can come out and stand on them and get range, so as the enemies come in, they can pick them off. And then you keep your melee back here and eventually get them to go out if needed. Everything is decomposing out here. So this is kind of a storage room. I guess we'll put the kitchen in here maybe. What kind of room types do we have? We need a workshop, a library. A library is going to help our research speed. So maybe we get that going early on. We need some churches, bedrooms we've got. I think we might do the library next. Now I keep warning that you need enough storage space here for your books. So we'll make a dedicated storage room, maybe in the basement for books later on. They continue the wall here. Let's uh, cancel this for now. We don't have to go that deep into the forest. Eventually, you'll cut down all the trees. So you want to build a tree farm at some point, but not enough beds. Has that message been there for a very long time? It might have been. I gotta turn the room over really off. Can't see anything. It's hard to see. Okay, we, what the heck? Why am I seeing this through the floor? There is no floor. What the heck have I done? It all collapsed. <laughs> oh, that's bad. I think it collapsed. Uh, okay, we need some beams there. I can't see what the heck I'm doing here. Okay, we'll try to put some beams in. Put in beam. Right here. Oh, we already have one right there. Stick one there. Is the floor gone? Yeah, it's clearly gone. <laughs> it totally fell in. It totally fell in. Okay, we'll try to replace it. Uh, we'll use... um. We'll mix and match our flooring here. Oh, I 
really messed this room up. It all collapsed. We could put a post down there as well. Just to help things out. I think the beam will be sufficient, but we can maybe put another beam in right there. And then extend the floor across. Kind of restore things up here. If we can see what the heck we're doing. I do really like this game, but the building is just, it's, I'm just not a very 3D person, maybe. So with all the overlaying stuff, it's kind of hard to see what they're doing sometimes. There's too much cruft in the way. Okay, I should be able to extend this floor now. Sometimes it's hard to, like, you're... It's, it's hard to tell which Z level you're building on. It does a pretty good job of showing you, but... Okay, the floor has been restored. Uh, all these doors and walls broke, so let's put those back up. Stability 3, stability 4. Uh, that's a hole in the floor, we gotta fix that. Yeah, we might need to add some posts in the future. Stability 2, that's not good. Okay, we'll see if we get a cave in here. Hopefully not. You get a plus 4 mood bonus if um, for like a shared bedroom and you get a plus 8 if it's your own bedroom. Okay, we're gonna let them join. Welcome. Let's make sure we keep their schedules in sync here. Copy, pasta, pasta. And manage, same deal. All headgear, fine. What are these two good at? Marksman or melee? Melee. We really need to build some weapons as well. Any, let's do... I don't think... We'll do all weapons, see if they can pick anything up. Uh, all armor. Well, it's called good armor, but it's really all armor. We'll see if they have anything to wear. We can actually get equipment off the raiders. Instead of making it. But eventually we'll make it as well. Okay, now we got to put some doors back on. Get these bedrooms, bedrooms. Okay, we got six people. One, two, three, four, five beds. We need a sixth bed, but kind of out of room here. Uh, we can't really stuff another one in there. We need, we need more room. We can make a shared... We'll do, do a shared bedroom in the hallway. That's not very nice, but it's better than nothing. We'll build a few because there's going to be more people coming in. This will be the flop house and then the deluxe bedrooms for the early the early members. Okay, we're swimming in food here, I think. Raw food, 350. Enemies are coming. I didn't notice that. That's actually good. We only have one archer, so it might be a rough fight. We do have more weapons here. Flimsy iron mace, sturdy longbow. Do we have anyone with archery... Or Marksman 10. Marksman 0. Marksman 8. 7. 5. 2. 8. So eventually we'll have some with 10. And let's make sure someone picks up these weapons. All weapons. Oh, no weapons. What the heck? What's going on here? 
melee. Melee two-handed. Ranged. Melee one. All weapons. All weapons. They should come and pick this up. This flimsy iron mace. As long as I got my... Let's check all weapons. No. Let's allow... Everything, I guess. Except for really broken down stuff. Now they should come pick them up. They did? Okay, good. Uh, 11 hours. Okay. Let's go down here. Make sure, Let's make sure this is all built out. Food storage. Looking nice. Everything's still preserved. Oh! Decaying because of ground type. That's fixed now. Temperature. 27 days. Okay, that's pretty good. That's... Once we get through summer, in two days, it should cool, start to cool down, and this will be good. I think we're good for food storage for now. Let's extend the food storage zone. Okay, I think we're good for food storage. We'll have to fix this pylon at some point, but for now, I'll just leave it. And food. We're probably got. We're probably making too much food here. So this this zone, I'm gonna shrink a little bit. The flax will shrink a bit. I can always build these back up later. And the herbs. Uh, let's shrink that as well. It work. Shrink zone. Let's go on here. I, th I think I have to select it first. Shrink zone. Shrink zone. Okay. Imminent. Imminent. Yes, I can talk. Okay. Let me know in a comment if you know if there's a way to select all people at once. You can drag, like, drag a square around them all, but sometimes that becomes a little bit lame later on. Now they could just pour in here, but they should attack. Our guys, let's draft them all, and let's get them. Let's get the. Let's get them near the front door, and put the archer up here. In fact, let's get the archer out on this post, and we want to defy them so they attack. Here they come. There's quite a few of them. I don't know if they're going to wrap around. You know what, let's try to, uh... Is there any way we can complete our wall in time? That would be nice. Probably should have done that before. But, uh, let's see if we can complete this in time. How much wood do we have? Quite a bit. Let's get one of our dudes here. Nicola. Let's get you over here. Prioritize building that wall. Probably won't have time to build that wall, but <laughs> we'll try. They might actually go for her, which would be bad. Where are they coming from? Well, actually, they're coming from that corner. You know what? Hmm. Okay, forget it. She's not going to make it in time, so we'll draft her and bring her back. Here they come. I'm actually going to bring everyone out the front. We'll see what they do. We'll bring out everyone out the front door. They're just going to pour in, aren't they? Yeah, as they should. And then we'll get our archer here. They shouldn't be able to reach... Oh yeah, they come right up the stairs. I'm an idiot. Okay, let's get in there and do 
some damage. Oh, they're, they're, for some reason they're going after my pyres. You know what, we want them to come to us. Because then our archer can do as much damage before they get to us. This is going to be a, a bit of a bloodbath, I think. We're going to have to focus fire people here. Kill that guy. Okay, he's dead. Next. Oh, they're going to need my archer. Let's run away. <laughs> and next. We just have to... I should flee in a bit here. Okay, one of our one of our guys is injured. Margaret, run! Jonathan, keep running along the wall. Okay, now we gotta get this guy. Jonathan can just kite. Kill him. Run. <laughs> Why aren't they all attacking? Keep running, but you're not going to be able to run in a second. Uh, run. Oh, he can't run that way. Run along the wall. Once this guy dies, what is going on here? What are they doing? Oh, they're killing him. He's not taking much damage. He's not getting hit. He's hiding in the stairs. Oh, man. Get out here. Oh, man. The game. This archer's having a bad time of it. He's not damaged yet, though. Okay. Okay, here comes this idiot. Nikolai, you go back here. guys finish him off. He was stuck in the stairs. That's some kind of bug. Okay, you two go rest. And this guy should be dead. There we go. Damn bugs. Okay, and then... They're not. There we go. There we go. Adric. Evade. Speed things up. Okay, he's dead. Okay, yeah, that was fun. Everyone go about your business. Let's uh, unforbid all this stuff. They do like to attack these pyres for some reason. Don't know why. Okay, I gotta make sure they're all scheduled here. Convalesce. We're gonna set that to one for everyone. Same with tending. Maybe less so on our um, less medically inclined. Okay, no one died. It wasn't a complete failure. We're gonna burn those bodies up, just like in RimWorld. Now, if we get this wall done, then it'll become much easier because they should all come here, and we can just focus fire them down. It makes it a little bit cheesy. The game mechanics are a little bit cheesy that way, but... What are you gonna do? Any of you guys watch Big Love? Not Big Love, um, Big Mouth? There's like... There's a... Ghost... No, he's like a... Puberty... Guy... Thing... Anyway, you have to watch the show. He always says, like, what are you going to do? Or something like that. Anyway. I'm not doing it justice. OK, 
Okay, there goes the wall. That's priority number one. Let's make this the library, maybe? I should have made my buildings way deeper. Let's fill in that hole. Don't do that there anymore. Yeah, I should have made my buildings way deeper. But you know what we can do? We can just... We'll build them, like, in subunits. And then we can have doors in between them. I think that'll work fine. Make sure this is built. Um, there's something forbidden underneath that. That's why it's not getting built. Um, someone come haul this. Someone come haul this. Okay, now we can finish the wall. A final piece. Sealed, sealed, sealed. Okay, I like it. It's looking good. Get that tree out of there. We must not have any trees in our front yard either. They won't like seeing these bodies, but... Ooh, that's kind of a nice uh, weapon. Probably better than the not oh, sturdy, flimsy. Let's swap out the flimsy for the sturdy, maybe. Flimsy. Make a lot. Start using this. Equip that. How's this one? A sturdy wooden spear. Probably better than the crappy mace. Okay, summer, day 12, we should be going into fall soon, soon here. Do some rotten vegetables. Let's make sure there's no waste allowed in here. Waste will disallow that, and all the waste will pile out front here. That way I can just, um, you know, rot away in the front yard. In the heat. Okay, this is all, this is all iron actually, probably should dig this before I, uh, hmm. We'll dig these few bits under the wall and then fill them in with wood piles. And then later on if we need more iron we'll dig this out. Oh, there's a guy on here. <laughs> Oh no, are we gonna get stuck here? Is this some debris gonna fall on the ground and get stuck in there? I don't want that to happen. Don't fall in the hole. Another hailstorm, jeez. Let's get this out of the way. I don't want things falling in the hole. It, did it fall in the hole? No, let's let's plug it back up with some wood. Crispy. Yeah, I feel much better about the next raid coming in. We'll have to skill up Jonathan. And we'll have to make some more bows. We should probably get on the research here. Let's think about doing some more research. What do we want next? Stone block cutting, not super... Wooden weaponry. Short bow, yes please. Okay, we got that. We need to build the workbench for that. Settlers are idle. We'll fix that. Let's build the back of the building here. Okay.
going a bit over schedule here, but that's uh, on purpose. I just want to be able to get through some stuff here. I think my rooms are way too skinny. I think what we'll do is probably just put a door here and then we'll extend back. We'll do like, a, this will all be doubled up so we have tons of room. Maybe just a giant block. I won't build a double door, this is just in, to internalize the rooms here. Let's get this copied. And I won't be able to build a floor here without some beams. So let's put some beams in. We'll do them every one, two, three, four. We'll do them every three or so. One, two, we can't stick one there, so we'll go here, there. And then we'll maybe put a door here so we can get through. into the next segment. So we'll have all these internal doors. Autumn is here. Sturdy savage play armor is decomposed. What, why? Unroofed. Oh, I never put the, I never put the ceiling on. Uh, that's great. <laughs> That's great. Okay. Uh, you guys are really like, screaming at the screen. Put the roof on! Okay. Um, we'll get that roof on there. And we'll do a similar door. Right out here. Okay, here we go. This is this is coming together. This will be like the Borg hive. Now, can we do this floor? Yep, it's it's gonna allow it. Perfect. All the way across here. Lovely. We could build a cube. We could build like a three by three by three. So three up, three along, and then three deep, maybe. We have room for that. Then we can get all these customized rooms, which give bonuses. Not very sexy, but oh, look at the look at the weather effects. I love it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Maybe I can make this my screenshot if I can center things just right. Hmm. Maybe if I rotate with the mouse, there we go, that's a little bit better. Fort Bragg. I can't seem to change the camera angle anymore. Come on, that's it. Oh, maybe if I zoom in, there we go. We could probably use some windows as well. Oops, that's not what I want to do. Yeah, put some windows in. It's kind of, kind of, scary the way it is right now. Sometimes they leave the doors open, I guess. I'm not sure what causes them to do that. Default, keep open, locked, okay. Settlers are idle, that's never good. Let's get that floor on there. My computer is very loud, it's overheating. Did we get this door in there? I don't think I put it in yet. Over here. And we actually have a ceiling on here, right? A oh, roof? Yeah. Okay. Let's put some windows in. Now if I remove this column, are we gonna have a disaster? One, two, one, two. Will things collapse? Hopefully not. Some wooden windows. These can be open and closed, I think, to help regulate the temperature. Build up your defenses. Spike trap and these Merlins. We can we could use these um, to help protect our archers at some point, but they haven't sent us any archers at us yet, so 
Okay, everyone just slept in the wrong place. I think I have maybe made a mistake. Why are they not sleeping in their beds? Uh, cause the ceiling collapsed again. Hmm. <laughs> oh man. More beams, I guess. Uh, wooden beam right here. Jonathan, wake up and get the beam built. That's not what I wanted. Not a deconstruction. Okay, it's not working at all. Go back to sleep. Let's check their moods. I don't think they're very happy now that I destroyed their bedroom. Job satisfaction. Hungry, ugly apparel, desperately thirsty. Oh yeah, we gotta get some wine going for these guys. Wine. I could keep playing forever here. I should wrap things up, but I'm gonna just keep going a little bit here. Get things tucked away. Settlers are starving. Got 20 meals waiting for them. That should not be a problem. Let's cook. Let's cook. Let's stockpile 40 meals instead. Because we're growing in size here. We'll let them finish the construction. This stuff is protected now, right? Inside the spare room. Yeah, it looks good. Okay. We got bushes in here. <laughs> I'm going to add some more beams just because I'm paranoid about the structure. Wooden beam. Yeah, let's just go crazy with the beams. We'll over engineer this puppy, especially if we want to go three levels high. Hopefully you guys can't hear my fan struggling. My video card's melting down. <laughs> okay, what's up with this window, guys? How are we doing for wood? 709. Okay, that room I think is good. It has no floor. So we'll get a, give it a wicker floor. Because uh, we have lots of sticks, and we're going to have even more over the over time. Got the two shrines. We want to build shrine rooms eventually. But we really need to start making weapons. Bowers table. So we can make uh, some bows. Um, we need a workroom for that. I guess we'll make this the... I was going to make this the library. Let's put the workroom on the bottom. This could have been a workroom, but this will be like a multi-purpose room. Uh, we'll put the workroom on the second floor. I mean the uh, library. We'll do that next episode though, because I'm out of time here. So I hope you enjoyed that episode. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I'm trying to hit that uh, 100k sub goal uh, before the year is out. I don't know if it's possible, but I'm going to try. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Let me know your tips and suggestions. Always helpful. Um, ideas for like the visuals, because this is going to be kind of ugly. But it's very utilitarian. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.